This is the Gizmo Show Soccer Alert. Okay, let's get straight to the news. In a recent interview with Bobby Warshaw, Greg Berhalter did not reveal why Joe Scali wasn't given a call in the last World Cup window. But he did reveal that not more than a maximum of eight converted passes in a row were allowed by the Canadian opponent in the last Canada vs. U.S. game. When reached for further comment, Greg said, we dominated. After the game in my post-match, I praised mm-hmm. the effort of, of a few individuals and thought they had an okay. outstanding effort in the game. Uh-huh. This game, I can't single anyone out. I think it was an entire team effort that was outstanding. Oh, we what? asked them to be dominant. What? We asked them to embrace the conditions, embrace the physicality of the oh, opponent. They embraced and I think we did that and, and more. More! Um, it, it's hard for me to remember a performance away from home this dominant um, without getting a result. But where were so their goals? Dominant, we did. Um, without getting a result. Do- so I'm this dominant. Do- um, dominant? Getting a result. Greg. So I'm this dominant. Stop it. Um, without getting no. a result. So. Well. The turd will no longer be allowed to make a narrative inducing announcements at the U.S. soccer press conferences. He will only be allowed to say things like this. Next up, Stephen Goff. Next up, Brian Schretter, etc., etc. In other news, Christian Titz will remain the manager at the Magdeburg in Germany where several Americans ply their trade. He is not to be confused with these Christian Titz. <laughs> Pete Dowdit was seen frolicking in the snow at the skiing resort he made very famous. Breck Sh- oh, this is just in. Hot news. Breck Shea has just been eaten by a snake in the Florida plan ha- panhandles. Breck Shea has been eaten by a snake in the Florida panhandles. There are few details, but apparently he attempted to pick up a 30-foot anaconda and place it in a pond. He was strangled, then swallowed, but authorities and teammates were able to remove him from the snake's stomach before he suffocated and died. So he is still alive. There could be serious bone-crushing damages, however. This has been... This has been your soccer alert report. Your U.S. soccer alert report. Thank you for joining us. Good night. This has been the Soccer Gizmo Soccer Show.